In this video, we will look at using scripts to automate SCS game archive extraction. You won't need any previous experience writing scripts. The links in the description contains everything you need. However, this video will show you how to use them to extract all archives into the same directory for use later. And the video will show you how you can tailor the scripts to your needs. First we will copy SCS Extractor to the game installation directory. Then we will create a new text document and change its extension to that of a batch file. But, you may need to change how Windows shows file extensions first. You change this in the File Explorer by opening the Tools menu, clicking Folder Options, going to the View tab, and unchecking Hide Extensions for Known File Types. Now, right-click the batch file, and select Edit. Or alternatively, edit with Notepad++. I am using this editor at all times when making mods, and I highly recommend you do the same. It provides all the necessary tools and functions for text-based files, be it the game's files or otherwise. You don't have to manually type this script. You can copy it from the linked forum post in the description. To run the script, you can double-click it. The script will attempt to extract all SCS game archives in the folder. You needn't worry about the archives that cannot be extracted. Their contents cannot be modified either way. Once the script has completed, it will ask you to press any key to continue, and then the script will close. All the files have now been extracted and can be found in the newly created Extracts folder. If you don't want the files extracted in the game's installation folder, you can modify the script slightly. The backslashes before the quotation marks are called escape characters. They are needed because of how the command for files works. The extracted files, after modifying the script, now appear at the specified location. It's a good idea to rename the folder in relation to what game version it was extracted from. This is all for this part on extracting the game's archives. Once again, all the links you need can be found in the description. In the next and final video on extracting the game's archives, we will look at how you can use Mod Studio to do the same thing, should use a desire.